India is a country rich in biodiversity. It has a wide range of ecozones ranging from high mountains, tropical and deciduous forests, swamps and plains. It is home to 410 species of mammals. Some of them are the lions found in Gujarat, Tigers in varied areas like Madhya Pradesh and South India, leopards found across India, the endangered golden langurs of Assam. Elephants found in many areas of the country. The gibbons, the only apes in India. The other varied kinds of langurs and such other mammal species. It holds around 1,250 species of birds. Some are critically endangered, like the Great Indian Bustard. There are birds like the bar-headed geese that fly over the Himalayas. The beautiful flamingos that need only specific algae to feed on. Other beautiful water birds. The near threatened hornbills and such other beauties. India is also a land that has nearly 1,500 species of flowering trees and plants. It is home to 197 types of amphibians exhibiting the beauty in their own way. It caters as home to thousands of different kinds of insects. Snakes and other reptiles, nearing roughly 408 species, are also an important composition of its biodiversity. All these are actually a part of our nation's heritage and we should be proud of it. This biodiversity is not just found in forests or jungles, but also very near to our homes. Urbanization is leading to these animals, birds and others now moving into our homes. Or could we say that we have encroached the areas of these beautiful creatures? <laughs> 